I'm regional media film critic Sean Patrick with a review of Florence Foster Jenkins starring Meryl Streep and Hugh Grant. Cosme McMoon? That's me, sir. Come. What should I play? Well, I really don't mind, as long as it's not too loud. <laughs> you know. Well, I must say, I think you're absolutely ideal. <laughs> Did I mention that I also compose? And he also composes. Yes, I'm sure he does. Florence Foster Jenkins stars Meryl Streep in the title role of a society madam who decides one day that she'd like to have a concert at which she could sing, even though she really can't. She's absolutely terrible at singing, though she doesn't realize that, and her husband, played by Hugh Grant, does a great job of shielding her from that information, especially going out of his way to keep critics from letting her know that she can't sing. All this is building up towards not one but two concerts, one of which w comes off well and the other, well, you have to see for yourself in Florence Foster Jenkins. The film is not bad, especially as well acted as it is by Meryl Streep, Hugh Grant, and uh, Simon Helberg from The Big Bang Theory, who plays her uh, pianist. Uh, this movie, however, doesn't quite know what it wants to be. It's a movie that wants to both laugh at Florence Foster Jenkins and have you feel sorry for her. Uh, this is a deluded old woman who thinks she can sing when she can't and wants to hold concerts to celebrate her singing, but doesn't realize how terrible she is. We're supposed to laugh at that along with the bullies who are also kind of laughing at her but also feel sorry for her and Meryl Streep delivers a very sympathetic performance in the film uh, as this deluded woman who doesn't realize she can't sing but the movie doesn't have a real opinion of it on its own are we supposed to laugh at Florence or are we supposed to feel sorry for her the movie wants us to have uh, really make up our own mind, and in so doing, it comes off as wishy-washy. It comes off as unable to decide the kind of movie that it is, and that's really unfortunate. It wastes uh, three pretty good lead performances, and in the end, I can't recommend Florence Foster Jenkins simply because it doesn't seem to have its own perspective. I'm Sean Patrick.